Hello, here we are in question four for 2.5. And again, we are uh, utilizing Hooke's Law for springs, but we're given different information this time around. We're given our force of 17 newtons and to compress the spring 0.8 meters from the equilibrium position. So we're given an X and we're given our force, but we don't have our K, so we need to solve for K. So we're gonna zoom in here, set up our equation. We have 17 equals K times our, our X, 0 0.8. So we just divide each side by 0 0.8. That gives us 17 over 0 0.8 equal to K, 0 0.8 over 0 0.8, which cancels, which gives us 17 over 0 0.8 equals K, which is equal to 21.250. So, now we can rewrite our part one. I shouldn't have boxed it because that's not our final answer. But our part one will now be f of x is equal to 21.250x. And that is our part one. Part two, now that we have our f of x, we can simply plug that back in into our integral. Let's wait to do the bounds first. Just write our f of x, have that done dx, can't forget that. Now we want to compress that to 0.3. Alrighty, so 0 to 0 0.3. And then that's it. We have our integral set up. That's part 2 done. Simple as that. Um, now, a little bit more difficult part. We need just to compute it. Um, it's not difficult as in X's or power rules or methods, but it's difficult as in you have decimals and you're just going to have to plug it into a calculator. Um, so part three is um, integral 0 to 0.3, 21.250x dx, using power rule here, so 21.250x squared multiplied by the reciprocal 1 half bounds from 0 to 0 0.3. I'm going to plug that in. 0 0.3 squared over 2. The zeros will cancel everything out. So it's just going to be minus 0. And this, evaluating this in the calculator, will give us 0 0.956. And that is our answer to part 3, and that's part 4. Or question 4.